In this Asteroid Day exclusive, we introduce you to people who are leading the efforts to investigate asteroids in our solar system, including their potential for great destruction of all we find precious on Earth. If you want to deflect an asteroid, you have to push on it somehow. You have to push on it by hitting it with something or by exploding a nuclear explosion next to it or by gently nudging it, but all those methods depend on the structure of the asteroid, the strength of the asteroid, the density of the asteroid. We have to know all these things in order to properly give it that little nudge so that it drifts away from its trajectory and doesn't hit the Earth. When a survey discovers an asteroid, we are basically trying to characterize the object from its orbital elements. So if you're doing something beyond the orbital elements, for example, if you want to find out how fast it's rotating, what it's made of, you know, what are its surface properties? Is it covered with regolith or is it bare rock? You know, this is the next step beyond the orbit. Uh, think of it like you're going in a forest and you're taking account of all the animals that are there. Uh, that is the first, you know, step in the sense that you're trying to find out where, which animal is in the forest. So surveys are kind of our first eyes and ears in the forest. Characterization is trying to find out how the lions behave, when they come out, when they eat, what they eat, when they sleep. So it's the next step beyond finding out what is out there. Many asteroids contain organic material. We know asteroids made a lot of impact onto Earth, especially when it was born at the end phase of the Earth formation. Uh, they probably brought the water on Earth we have good evidence for that. And what we want to see now is uh, whether when they brought all this material on the Earth, maybe they also brought all the material that made life emerge on Earth. So maybe they, let's say, created life on Earth, and now they are able to finish it. So they, you know, they have the, the pros and cons is balanced. <laughs>